In the video today, I'm going over how to soft reset your Pixel Fold if the screen freezes or is not responsive. Welcome back to another video. I'm your tech guide, Wayne. Today I want to walk you through what to do if your touchscreen freezes or is not responsive on the Pixel Fold. So, what you'll need to do is super simple. So, I'm going to do it closed because it's a bit easier to hold the phone that way. So, we're basically going to hold down on the power and the volume down button until the screen goes black. Okay? So, power, volume down. You want to hold them at the same time. Let's try it now. One, two, three, hold. It's going to take a screenshot. Just continue to hold the buttons. It'll take a few more seconds and then the screen will go black. There we go. Now, it took a lot longer than usual. It actually took about, I wanna say about 30 to 45 seconds. So just make sure you continue to hold the buttons until the screen goes black. And then the phone is going to basically come right back on. So it's gonna turn off, that button combination just shuts it off, turns it back on. And usually if the issue you had was a software related issue, that will clear the phone and you'll be good to go. However, if it was not software related, if it was an issue with your screen, then when the phone does come back on, the touchscreen still isn't gonna work. So if after all this happens, if it takes you back to that main screen and your touchscreen still is not working and you try to open the phone and the same thing, touch screen is not working, that means you have a bigger problem and I would encourage you to reach out to Google support directly to uh, walk through what your options are to troubleshoot the phone. All right, hope you guys found that helpful. Again, was a short and to the point video. Just wanted to explain the process, show you exactly what it's gonna look like and hopefully set you up for fixing your phone if it's a minor thing, if it's something that is more, um, if it's something that requires a lot more work, make sure you reach out to Google support and walk them through where to take the phone to have it serviced properly. If you found that video helpful, hit the like button down below. If you're not already a subscriber, hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more videos. Take care and as always, have a good one.